Okay, today I'll talk about uh, the new design of Ruby's documentation. Uh, my name is Ito Yanagi. So, hello everyone. Uh, I'm our current our documenter and a member of Ruby core team. And <coughs> I'm so nervous because it's last session time of all speakers. It's so hard for me. So, and uh, I'm a member of ASUXRB. Uh, ASUXRB is convened every Ruby Tuesday uh, because it's based on Shadow RB. And all Ruby Kagi, Ruby Kagi session speakers of RubyConf 2018 are from ASUXRB, right? Oh. <clears throat> and I'm working at Space Pirates. I'm a crew of space pirates. I'm pirates. Thank you. And uh, I'm developing front end by JavaScript for my job. Uh, it's so hard mm, I, because uh, I don't know JavaScript well. <laughs> and uh, my hobby is climbing. Last month, I went to Malaysia's jungle just after RubyConf Malaysia uh, 1918. Uh, this is bonfire in Django, and uh, over 100 meter waterfall in Django, uh, and I climbed there. And this is unknown bug in Django. We are afraid. <laughs> unknown bug. <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> and just before this Ruby Conf uh, 2018. I was planning to climb to Malibu Creek Rock Bowl in Malibu Creek State Park, uh, but I didn't know a forest fire of the area, and the Uber driver didn't know where it's burning, so Uber driver said to me, all roads are closed, please get off here. <laughs> uh, but, but I tried to call new Uber, but the area is out of service. <laughs> there are no citizens. Because all of them are escaped. So I tried to escape from the area by walking to a bus stop, uh, maybe around uh, three or four miles. <coughs> but the closed area was spreading faster than my walking speed. There were so many fire spots, I was afraid. As it turned out, I was rescued by a police car. The disaster is so severe, seriously. But the area must be sure to reconstruction. So I back to the area. I, I didn't yet enjoy rock climbing in the area. Everyone, after Malib is reconstructed, please go there. I guess it will be a good help for there. Okay, and next, uh, I'm a Ruby committer. I became a Ruby committer last month at Programmer.net. Matsuda-san has introduced us <coughs> Res committer. Uh, he's so old Res committer and Ruby committer. It means dual committer and creator of community and action args and uh, activity creator and so on. He's great, uh, Jimonosas and uh, founder of uh, Asak Service, thank you, and a uh, chief organizer of Ruby Kike. Wow, perfect, he's a great guy, uh, if, if only he, he more uh, punctual. Uh, and he's a last Ruby hero. I, res I respect him because he's a last Ruby hero. Last Ruby hero, okay? Great, very cool, really cool. Ah, so jealous, so <laughs> a last Ruby hero. So I want to be a last Ruby hero too. Uh, but the Ruby hero award ended. It's so sad, so it's so, by the way, the Ruby committers are 97 people according to Shibata-san's slide of Ruby uh, Alexa Kampf, Taiwan. Uh, 20, 2018 at May. 
The following month of that, I started attending developers meeting of Ruby core team, uh, maybe seven, mm, seven months ago. Other committers always said to me, when will you be a new committer? You are our documenter, aren't you? But, um, and I always replied to him was, I wanna be a 100 Ruby committer, okay? 100. Wow, it sounds glorious. Shibata-san counted Ruby committers by, <coughs> by <coughs> following, following command. <coughs> Please wait. <coughs> I still have cough, I still have some cough because, because I took so, I, I took smoke so much. Uh, the fire, fire incident, so. <coughs> uh, please, pl oh, okay, pl pl uh, please read instead of me. <coughs> well, <coughs> are you reading? Okay, no problem. Um, I'm just reading. Uh, so, um, listeners, are reading this. This style is uh, best presentation style, I guess. So, uh, if we want to use this style, uh, listeners are reading the slide. Um, if we want to use this, uh, please transfer to my bank account. It's new business of bus uh, cult. Okay. <coughs> okay. Uh, this is just current data, uh, this, this one. This, this is just current data of administrations of, well, thank you. <laughs> New order. Uh, this is just current data of administration of subversions SSH connection. It means Ruby committers are uh, 97 people. Back then, uh, 97 people. <coughs> and uh, a committer said, Committers are counted that subversion accounts have committed even once except bots. It means 101 people because many of the accounts doesn't register SSH keys, keys and they've committed long ago. So, and as the committer said, uh, this is bot and he, uh, he, he means uh, Mulaken san. He has two accounts. Uh, it means 99 people, 99 Ruby committers. Yet another Ruby committer said, uh, yet, yet another, uh, Ruby committer said, now remember, new committer comes today. Wow, no! Ah, so I said, please give me a, a, count, a commit bit as soon as possible. So, uh, and I committed my first one before the newcomer. <laughs> thank you, thank you. And after that, I went to RubyConf Malaysia as a speaker. Uh, besides, Aaron Patterson and Shibasan were speakers of it. Uh, and the Ruby committers are 99 people according to Shibata-san's slide of Ruby Camp Malaysia last month because it, it, it's just after my first commit. Not 99, uh, a committer said to me, congrats, you are 100 plus or minus two <laughs> committer. <laughs> 100 plus or min minus two, I, I, I understand that. I cannot understand that. Uh, why? So there's, there are as many opinions as there are people. Okay, I talk about uh, the new design of Ruby's documentations, okay? <coughs> Today, I talk about the following sections. Arduk features and console editors and the new IRB, okay? First, uh, I talk about uh, Arduk features. Arduk has so many namespaces of processing target software inside. Okay, and Arduk has modules and classes and methods and attributes and ghost methods 
uh, and uh, attributes, growth methods. And this is example class, uh, Ruby Conf class. It's perfect example for here. <coughs> and I added a method, Aaron Patterson, uh, with uh, document comment uh, because uh, I heard uh, he back to Seattle uh, just before he, just before this. Uh, and our uh, method Aaron Patterson. Aaron Patterson method returns meow. <coughs> and uh, I added method missing method with no doc <coughs> because it's just for uh, meta programming. Uh, method missing method is called only when undefined method is called. And the method missing method takes uh, the undefined method name. In this case, <coughs> if the undefined method is named uh, takoya kikamen, the method missing returns meow. Okay? Uh, do you know takoya kikamen? Uh, several years ago, he came to Ruby Kike, but everyone don't know him. Uh, and I got his picture, so I show it specially. <laughs> everyone don't know him, who, he, who he is. And I added method, uh, I added document for the method missing, uh, method missing metaprogramming method. Uh, this is a document with column method, column directive. This is document for takeaway common method, but it's not real method, it's ghost method by method missing. Uh, Tokakami is not real, like Spider-Man, so this style of documents of called ghost method uh, in our uh, source code. <coughs> ghost, okay? Look carefully, his facial expression is like a ghost. And this is lobby of this hotel, okay? He will be bastard. <laughs> this is one scene of uh, Ghostbusters. Uh, he said, uh, hey, everyone see a ghost. I know him. <laughs> and this is generated document uh, uh, as HTML. Uh, there are our own Patterson method with weird document and uh, Takoya Kamen's method by meta programming. Uh, it's just a ghost comment, but uh, this generated document has uh, the ghost, doc, um, ghost methods document. I don't know who he is. Okay. RDAC has dynamically generated ghost methods, classes, modules, attributes, and so on by metaprogramming. And next, I talk about uh, console editors. Ruby needs a new, uh, new uh, read line as a native library. A uh, new read line is powerful line editor for taking user input. Ruby has a wrapper library of new read line as a standard library. It's so important. Uh, are you using read, uh, read line? Mm -hmm. Choose a prompt and read the input line with line editing. Uh, this is example called require read line and uh, next line. It means uh, take user uh, input as a line. Line editing is move cursor, delete characters, and use history uh, by history back. Uh, and this is small IRB example. Uh, look at redline and take, uh, take user input as a line and evaluate it. It's a simple IRB example. GNU read line is used by shell, uh, for example, such as TC shell, bash, and MySQL command line tool, and GNU debugger, and so on. So maybe 
maybe um, most developer most developer uses re uh, relying uh, some tools inside Ruby standard library uh, readline. It's it's just a Ruby standard library. Readline is used by IRB and Pry and Sora. <coughs> it's so famous simple framework for command line utilities. The readline library is very important for Ruby, but readline can be used only when Union Readline is installed before Ruby builds. This is an uh, example of Ubuntu Linux command after, uh, after install Ruby Readline and IBM install 2.5.3. Uh, it's so important command, so uh, you can share this command uh, on Stack Overflow. Okay. <laughs> And, and, uh, and if you forget this installing readline-dev first, Ruby doesn't have readline library. Uh, in this case, uh, prep helps to launch when Ruby doesn't have readline library. And it must be a trap to beginners. So I decided to re-implement readline library by pure Ruby uh, it's relying. Ruby 2.7 uses new, new relying by default and uses relying inside if doesn't have new relying. Re relying has three layers, keyboard input and line editing and build string as default encoding of the environment. First, keyboard input. Relying uses select, select is a POSIX, POSIX, POSIX function. Select a system call in Unix-like OSs and keep keyboard hit and get wide character in Win32 API to take keyboard input. And line editing. Uh, and I plotted Emacs bindings and BIA bindings from getting read line for line editing. Mm, this phrase is so hard because there are so many bindings and uh, beer binding, bindings are so, beer binding is not famous. I'm a user of GNU uh, read lines, beer bindings, but it's not famous. Uh, do you, are you using beer bindings of GNU uh, read line? Oh, two people. Uh, I, I, no, 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 no. I found one people at Brazil and one another one people at uh, Malaysia. So, uh, including me, maybe uh, five BI bindings users in the world. <laughs> it's enough for, for uh, it's enough to implement. <laughs> it was so hard. It was so hard. Maybe BI bindings. Uh, for example, uh, RB readline, RB readline is uh, just a gem, but it doesn't support uh, BI mode. Okay, so so I decided uh, it's a reason of uh, I dis that I decided to implement uh, the new readline compatibility library uh, because there are so many uh, BI bindings users in the world. Maybe over five people. <laughs> it's so important for me. And build strings by default encoding of the environment. Finally, I implemented by, uh, building strings as a default encoding of the environment. It's final phase, so I got up from work. I did it, okay? But it's too hard implementations. And but the implementation is broken in non-unicode encoding, so I re-implement whole line editing code. <laughs> no! <laughs> and key keyboard input phase, in key keyboard input phase, unicode characters is broken at the 
the time of first input, I fix it, fix, fix it and the combining Unicode characters uh, sometimes work in line editing. Uh, for example, the <coughs> United States of America flag emoji is combined from emoji U and emoji S. Uh, I show the dem uh, demonstration, okay? There, there are emoji U and emoji S. If I copy emoji U and paste it to new line and if I copy emoji S to new line. Of course, there are so many new emoji U and emoji S. But if I copy emoji S and paste just after emoji U, it will become, wow. It's the United States of America. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no! Table. Okay, I fixed the whole implementation of the layer due to lower layer, and all this failed, so I remake whole test. I worked out over several months, but I'm still fixing all source code and tests. <laughs> well, oh yeah, good, hello, yeah, oh, it's, it's, it's a bottle of programming, okay? Uh, it's spaghetti specifications. So, so hard. Ah, I cannot believe that. I concerned Ruby code team about the implementation problems and all, it's almost finished, okay? It will be adopted at Ruby 2.7. I, 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 can, I cannot for 2.6, <laughs> sorry. But there is still some work, for, uh, work to be done. It's red line. <laughs> The original also of IRB, Keiji-san, uh, do you know Keiji-san? He's a uh, good father of Ruby, too. Uh, so he's developing new IRB, it's Ray Ruby. Uh, Ray Ruby is, the, the name is based on re-IRB, but uh, it's Ray Ruby. <coughs> Ray Ruby uses, uh, an original line editor, red, red line inside. Red line is a multi line editor like JavaScript console in browser. Okay? Uh, I joined the development of red line because I know that console application development from scratch is a hell. I know well. Uh, for example, in current IRB, uh, this is example uh, of define method foo and call that, okay? If we want to change the method foo, press control P to history back. Please look carefully, last line. It's first history back, calling foo and the next history back, and next history back, uh, implementation of the method foo, and next history back, uh, the first, one, first line of the foo, foo method. RB can input only one line by histories, uh, by history back. You cannot fix method by histories, okay? Because it's line editor. What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> it's confused behavior for REPL, REPL because Redline is just line editor, so Redline solves the problem. Redline is roughly moving and has many te uh, technical problems. And this is current status of me. Uh, me and the Unix historical technical problems are fighting each other. And, but I can solve the problems of red, uh, uh, red, red, line, red, red line because I finished to solve them on my development. Uh, I will win the history of Unix, okay? Uh, wait, I'll fix it. 
Uh, this is so famous picture of uh, uh, early, early time of uh, Twitter's error page. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, new, uh, I talk about new IRB. This is an issue of my, uh, by, my, by me, uh, show documents when compilation. The issue has one patch. It has a new feature to IRB. If I press tab key one more, just after I press tab key to compilate namespace, IRB shows documentation. I show demonstration, okay? If I uh, press, uh, for example, put, uh, if I've, after that, uh, if I press, uh, if, if uh, I, I try to call uh, gsub, uh, uh, but I, I don't type last one, uh, B, but in this case, I press tab key, the method name is comp complete. And after that, uh, I press tab key more, uh, IRB show, uh, IRB or uh, read line show more, more uh, method list. And after that, with this patch, uh, if, I press, uh, if I press tab key one more, uh, uh, all the documents are shown. Oh, is it? Uh, <coughs> I guess that it's a great feature, but it's implemented by uh, techniques using strong force. When your read line has only one hook point, it's just for compilation. It's not for others, including showing documentation. So this feature sometimes, uh, sometimes generates confused behaviors. When your read line isn't good for adding new rich features to repo. And the Read line library in Ruby needs compatibility. So I can't change the behavior. But read line, read line is, uh, read line by Kajisan is a new user input library. It's great for adding new features. And IOB uses public methods, public methods method to complete the methods uh, for re receiver. The public methods has receivers method list, but doesn't support metaprogramming methods. But RDOC has a library can provide metaprogramming method list by ghost methods. Normal methods can shout publicly, but ghost methods is not public. So the ghost methods is based on metaprogramming and metaprogramming is important for Ruby. So RDAC can provide it for IRB. IRB fuses RDAC for treating namespaces with red line. Oh, so cute. Okay, I show, uh, I, I talk about uh, the overview of today's my presentation. Uh, today I introduced GNU readline, readline standard as a standard library, readline and readline and IRB and RB. Uh, the name is based on uh, readIRB. <laughs> <laughs> and it, it's so difficult to Japanese, for Japanese people because uh, Japanese language has not uh, R and L, <laughs> okay? It's so hard. <laughs> so I, I prepared uh, this, this speaking <laughs> before one month, one month ago because uh, it's so hard for me. Uh, re, 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 read line, <laughs> re, line, re, read line. IRB and RB. <coughs> Maybe it's better uh, than one month, one month ago. <laughs> if I use uh, Japanese, Japanese speaking, uh, there are 
Uh, today I introduce GNU Lead Line. Lead Line as a standard library, D Line, Lead Line, IRB, RailB. Huh? Arduino installs all the documents to Ruby's directory by default. Many users never use it because it's just for II, RI as a documentation uh, to like man command. In building Ruby or installing Ruby gems, uh, Arduino is running inside and it, it needs so many times. So, so many users use uh, no documents option. I think that it's a reason of that many users don't attach importance of uh, to documentation. I'll try to contain the generated documents to Ruby and Ruby Jam's distribution files. But it's so hard. So please remove no document option from your uh, GMRC. Uh, do, you, do you add no document option to GMRC? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Pal has Paddock and Python has DuckSwing and Go has GoDuck. All of them have documentation design. The design means coordinated behavior through all features and two chains, uh, like Ruby. I'd like to provide a new development experience on Ruby 3. So I talked about several features about new documentation design today, but probably I think that I'll change some features uh, of mm, I, I talked today. Because I think about only design, each feature is not important. Please wait for Ruby 3. I don't know that much is nice or not, but Ruby committers are working for Ruby gets nicer. I think Matt is, wow, it's time to finish my presentation time. <laughs> uh, I'm, so, I'm sorry, I have so, um, uh, many cough. Thank you, everyone. Let's enjoy the next last session. Uh, it's Q and way with Matt. Check this out to check that Matt is nice. Or, Okay, uh, okay, uh, thank you. Uh, and uh, any questions? Uh, uh, I, I'm, I'm hearing uh, a great questions from somewhere. Okay, uh, the question is, Matt is nice. Wow, great, great question, perfect. Uh, of course, Matt is nice, okay? Uh, but it doesn't matter. Uh, so because I think Please write some code um, without worrying, uh, worrying um, about anything. Uh, please write some code, uh, especially open source code. Um, it's only one justice for you or for us. So please join, join to open source development, uh, okay? Uh, thank you. That's all.